Finally, let's get to the big boss, uh, Mr. Banerjee. Uh, your two points that you like to see in the budget. You put me in a spot because uh, all my points have <laughs> well, been, been, been well used up by all the three who spoke before no, me. No, no, we're going but, to have a discussion on all the points again, but yes. Yeah, but, uh, but, but, but I, I you know, I, but I, I, I endorse all the points which have been talked about, like public investment in infrastructure, et cetera. But let me, let me try and uh, put, uh, uh, you know, uh, some new uh, thought, yes. which I am trying to be different from what the others said. Uh, one, of course, we should see the budget aiming to rejuvenate the rural demand. That's very, rural very critical. demand. Rural yes. demand. And uh, I mean, a holistic focus on rural economy, uh, encompassing both farm as well as the non-farm sectors. Very, very important to enhance competitiveness. So rural demand has gone down quite a lot, has it? Yeah, so we need to we need to see that we are we and, and, and as that. Naren yeah. mentioned, you know, as Naren mentioned also that we need to put more honey money in the uh, hands of uh, that particular sector. Both and even Vikram Kolhoskar mentioned, uh, if you get that demand, you will get first level entry uh, demand for, uh, you know, vehicles. Uh, yeah. Actually, what one would need to see a much more comprehensive sort of a statement, like you know, on competitiveness of agriculture, boosting right. boosting the consumption demand, need to step up investment in you know agri infrastructure things like cold chain warehousing logistics right. irrigation yeah these would really improve uh, the agriculture rural... needs focus that's a very good absolutely. point and, uh, absolutely your second rural, thing you'd like uh, to agriculture see... as well as non-agricultural rural economy yeah rural areas sorry yeah yeah and uh, second point you'd like to so, see in the so budget? something you know that's something where i think industry would also have a major role to play here uh, 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 of course, the government can uh, make many, many important announcements in the budget are two very critical areas where we have not seen happen much in India uh, uh, and a lot of scope technology, technology upgradation and R&D, research and development. It's, and, and it's just not only left to the government. So that uh, technology would be important when we talk about c competitiveness. Uh, so you right. know, I would like to see something like a overarching technology commission of India, uh, you know, which can coordinate, integrate, uh, synergize, Sanjeev, manage also types of technology. At innovation and- uh, Exactly, a technology you know, fund. Yeah, right. a technology and then fund. What do you, what do you uh, what's the nightmare for you? Two things you don't want to see. <laughs> yeah, so let's not give ideas today at your at your show. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but but definitely in agreement with what the others were saying. But I would definitely not like to see any reduction in outlays of schemes like the Mandrega, which which create livelihood and assets in the rural areas. It's, I'm I'm really taking on from the point, for first point that I said, no, and no, also no, no. I do not wish to see any reversal in any types of economic reforms process, which are strongly which has been strongly sort of initiated in many cases, that will really be better. Keep the off. reform process on. Uh, so yes, gentlemen, and, and one anything of the things... back will impact the business sentiment and or dampen the recovery yeah, that's process. A, yeah, yeah, that's very true. 